And for many people, what he does is making sure that he gets to people who may not be exposed to it. And he, he has a center and they do robotics. They actually build robots and they go into competition with those robots. Well, I was a pleasure and honor to help him open the next phase of his facility where he has the eSports. Any of you familiar with eSports? Well, I mean, they're the people who make big money, who play football and basketball and all that, but there are people who can make big money because they're good gamers. They can play electronic sports. So if you're interested in that, I want to get with James because I saw some of you raise your hands about a game. It would be wonderful to have a City of Atlanta team. I was just watching a big tournament that was on Channel 2 the other day. So there are other opportunities to, to express your passion. If you love playing games, play games for money. Play games to learn how to make games and make money off of making games. There's so many things that you can be passionate at. You just need to tell adults like us what you're interested in, and we will do all that we can to bring it to you. So if you're in here playing games, or making music, or playing basketball, or whatever your passion is, then you're less likely to be out there in the street for a random bullet, or even be one that's shooting them as well. We want to stop the violence in Atlanta, and we do that by making sure that we make your passions a reality. So let me know what you want, and I'll do my best to make sure it happens. Thank you so much. Okay, so I want to need y'all to get ready. So I want y'all to chant me, 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 So I can hear Meek Mill stepping into the building right now. He's going around giving the kids some dap real quick. The kids got real excited. So Meek is definitely in the building. Got a squad with him that came out that back room. I'm going to see if I can get to him after this presentation. If I can get through the goon squad, man, hopefully we get to him today. So on behalf of the Atlanta City Council, I'm not going to read it all, but I do want to read a few parts. And this is a proclamation by the Atlanta City Council in recognition of Robert B. Bill Williams' death. Whereas the Atlanta City Council is pleased to recognize Robert B. Bill Williams' day in the city of Atlanta, taking place March 25th, 2019 at Dunbar Recreation Center in Atlanta. And whereas Meek Mill is a critically acclaimed multi-platinum hip-hop artist, songwriter, entrepreneur, actor, and criminal justice reform advocate who hails from Philadelphia, he has evolved from one of Philadelphia's hottest underground rappers to among the world's preeminent musical artists. And whereas Meek Mill's used the public platform of his 2017 incarceration which spurred the international hashtag Free Meek Movement to generate awareness of the problems of criminal justice system. These include excessive probation regulations, a disproportionate bail system, and the lack of rehabilitation programs. The movement also highlighted how this disproportionately affects people of color. And whereas Meek Mills is the co-chairman of the Reform Alliance, which aims to advance criminal justice reform and eradicate outdated policies that perpetuate injustice. He also serves as one of the captains of Puma's newly launched Hashtag Reform Platform, which advocates for social justice, 
issues, and whereas recognized as a philanthropist through his nonprofit organization, Dream Chasers, he contributed $50,000 in 2018 toward the purchase of 60,000 water bottles to assist with the Flint water crisis. The organization also donated more than, yes, that's a good thing. He put his money where his mouth is. The organization also donated more than 6,000 backpacks to students in Philadelphia and $100,000 to children for Christmas giveaway. We welcome his support to launch the Cure Violence Atlanta to help reduce gun violence among the city's urban communities. And this is the fun part. Now, therefore, be it resolved that we, the members of the Atlanta City Council, on behalf of the citizens of Atlanta, do hereby recognize Robert Meek Mill Williams' death in the city of Atlanta. We got a brand new microphone we're going to submit to the studio here. I don't know who uses the studio here a lot. Uh, all I can really say is I'm not here to, like, to take a lot of credit for everything. My life, I was caught up in the justice system my whole life. I came up in the hood just like most of y'all in here. And, you know, I'm here to inspire, motivate kids. Be all you can be, do what you want to do. I remember I was stuck in the streets. People tell me I could be anything I want. I seen so much bad that I never used to believe it. So, you know, by the time I got 17, 18, I used to hustle hard every day to try to be a rapper and make millions of dollars to feed my family. So if you got a dream, keep chasing your dream. And why y'all this young stuff right now? So why, when you turn 25, 26 years old, you're not behind on life, got two kids, and trying to figure out what your career be. You know, you got social media. Uh, y'all got a studio at the tip of your fingers, a gym right here. Um, it's, it's so many things you can do, so I just want to say thank you and shout out to all of you for here um, for support. Thank you. Yeah. Let's give another round of applause for Meek Mill. That's dope. That's dope again. It's your boy Mo Cheese, a.k.a. Okay, so Grits. We down here still at the Dunbar Center. Meek Mills just got presented. Um, so this toned is down as they got quiet. Just presented a mic. Oh, beautiful. Oh. Oh, yeah. And I tell y'all, this mic is beautiful. Okay. It looks like it's uh, platinum and gold plated. Uh, I'll get I'll get a picture of the microphone here in a minute, or I'll, I'll get it from somebody as they they keep so that thing on wraps. But I'll get that picture. I'm gonna try to uh, see if I can catch me. But to be truthfully honest. Meek Mill just got off stage and is heading toward the door, which I thought might freaking happen. <laughs> it's all good. I said, I thought that might happen. Let me walk over here, man. I'm going to go over here and catch up with James. I know it's another presenter, but let me walk over and catch up with James so I can kind of try to blend in with that crowd with him real quick, like... Matter of fact, let me get back around so I can get to this next presenter for y'all as well, man.
because I wish I could control time. I don't get it. I mean, I really just don't get it. Which I continue with some stats. At least 15,549 people killed by guns in 2017 in the U.S. Let's get even more specific. Let's talk about Georgia. 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 11,591 people killed by guns in the last 10 years. Kill, 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 killing our own people like this is such a big thrill. Lost so much hate. I'm trying to see if James can give me a word in with me, y'all. Give me a high second. We're better than this, I must admit. I'm living in a time where kids are holding up signs saying, I don't want to die, 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 die. See, I ain't got time to die. I was born to be somebody. So I need to be alive. I'm fighting for my birth. I got a friend that needs to see me alive. I got people looking up to me as my time to shine. Put the guns down. Stop the violence so we can all survive. Society is at its all time high. And I hate the fact that I got a cry. From my eyes, I'm like a baby without a pacifier. I view the world as a hateful, ungrateful, Shameful, unstable, this taste can't wait to find. We gotta wake up or stay asleep. But staying asleep only leads to a continuation of deprivation by leaving our people below elevation, thus seeping the life out of their determination. We need to form a strong foundation to become great leaders and achievers. And believe me when I say I got my head held high, and I'm trying to eliminate the bad guys. We just can't let time pass by. And when I say I cry, I mean a battle cry. Because I'm tired and from required to kind of broken and unspoken. And I'm focused. I ain't doing no joking. I'm speaking just to speak. This right here is reality. Rumor says that we ain't gonna grow to be nothing. Cause there's always a shooter. But if we put the guns down and pay attention, then maybe we can reboot this. I'm a peacemaker, not a fighter. I wanna put together, not divide us. There's always hate they on unity. And I'm sick and tired of the foolery. We gotta come together, not kill each other. Cause I come in peace. That's just what I believe. I stand tall, all ten toes. Trying to be a hero, no competition. I'm on a mission. Gotta fight for my future. Cause society is like a wound. And we all need to suit you. Thank you. Y'all, uh, so I'm about to step out real quick. I'm gonna see if I can get James to get me in with Meek real quick. I know security is kind of sort of tight out this way, so I don't know if that's gonna happen. If it don't, it don't. If it do, then great. And uh, I think actually some of uh, Meek fam might be in the building. Yo, y'all, Meek fam. Yo, can I get one of y'all on real quick? I know it's probably going to be hard to get an interview with him real quick, man. But we actually on a live podcast right now. All right, <laughs> 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 man, we on, a, we on a live podcast we do right now, actually, man, that we uh we work with Music Education Group, man. Nobody don't run. Nobody, nobody don't run. Nobody don't want to be... Nah, we ain't planning to be. Actually, man, we on a live podcast right now, so it's a live feed. We work with Music Education Group as well, so we just we was able to come out and do the live podcast from here with James today. Ah, oh, man, if you want to spit, bro, you can cut. <laughs> Like I said, it really don't look look like they're going to be in and up out of this thing, man. So I ain't, ain't going to push too tough because I ain't trying to get uh, uh, hemmed up in here. If y'all was looking at what I was looking at, it ain't, it ain't real conducive to uh, trying to make no move on nobody at this very moment. So I'm definitely not going to do so. All right, man. So we're going to go back in here in two seconds. Y'all give me two seconds. We're going to fill back into the the actual event itself. It does look like, unfortunately, like I said, it, it probably would be one of those moments where Meek came in, kind of sort of did something real quick and, and was going to bounce straight out. Uh, I mean, it happens, but we were able to broadcast live for y'all from the event. So blessings on that as obviously My bad, y'all. I think I had a...